Lovely Nails and I am back. I am back with another episode of It's Motherhood. How did you find out that you're pregnant? Um, <clears throat> <laughs> okay, <clears throat> getting to know that I was pregnant, first of all, it was very surprising because he didn't come off like the type that would actually be like, it's okay, let's just keep being together. But then it's a good thing was supported and um, we moved on and life was okay so the other test came out negative and I was pregnant so I went to my mom because I was in school and she, she had to know mm. so she, when I got there I told her I'm pregnant like so first question Yambuza, are they going to let you be in school I was mm. like yeah they won't let me be in school because there are other kids that are pregnant so she thought she asked me, eh, so you saw your friends being pregnant and you also decided yeah, to be pregnant. Mm -hmm. I'm like, no, me, I didn't know that. It's like, oh, you did know. What did my mom get for no Did you have a dog or But eventually, she was okay. She's like, but she, also, by the way, Vivian, that shows that there is a, there was a, there's a, a relationship between you and your mom. Yeah. Because other, another child would maybe just hide from a parent mm. for a long time just but the fact that she went and told her and it's good mm. when i told her and she was okay with it then i had to move on with life i tell you didn't tell us when you told your boyfriend ah when you told the boyfriend so for me I, I told him we're having my baby so um around that time we he he got some issues and had to move to good his work village. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. How how many months were you when he, he left for a country? For home. Yeah, uh, it's yeah, when he left I was I was like one month pregnant, actually maybe just weeks. Mm. One month maybe. So for him he was done with school, he was not at campus. He was. He was, yeah. So he was at campus. Mm -hmm. He left um <clears throat> so when he left first like i was saying like i said earlier uh, it was for me it was an enjoyable moment because i remember my mom would always tell me yeah when i wanna go to the so i would be like <laughs> like I was, even when it was still flat because i knew i was pregnant because i got to no know way, it was just about to cover your so yeah <laughs> <laughs> i think most mothers now the one guy was like looking forward for my bump to come out so I was going that there is nothing even when I went there I think now I, I wanted to depend more on our conversations on phone but then I think when he got there also he got busy and all these other things and communication well, became slow and mm. funny so I got so emotional every time I would call and he wasn't picking, I would be crying. I would mm. so I'm well, baby, they call it baby swing, baby something. Oh, mood swing. I don't know. Mood swing. Mood swing. <laughs> you know hey. swing I want to smell my husband's clothes. <laughs> I don't know, I don't I don't know anyway. But so, so, the time the whole the whole pregnancy. Yeah. The whole Mama Tewamenya. <laughs> I used to be navy to be a bitch gun. The natural. Ah, I didn't express that. I felt like, because my, my mom told me that when you go, she told me, don't go to the toilet. Every time you go to me, you use a bucket. I can't be using a bucket. Then I have to hustle taking it yeah. there. No. So me, I thought I would just be going to the toilet and then I'd be careful. So, so when I went, there's this time I went to pee and then there was mucus like stuff. So I went and told her. She's like, eh, okay, so now we go. Yeah, she's saying that the, the uterus was now open. So we go to the hospital. So, and for me, Actually, I remember when I was doing the scan, they they told me that the baby had the the, the, cord. the cord around her neck, so I had already shared with my midwife. And mm. I wanted a name that people wouldn't change, like how you know, like Catherine, Cassie, Cassie. 
as I need one such name, say I go to Aviana, which if someone wants to cut it short, they'll say Avi. Mm. Yeah. Now the the scary part said coming in because remember they told us when you're positive, you baby is not supposed to feed on any other thing. When you're blah, blah, By the way, you should educate us about that. Mm. So uh, when you're <clears throat> when you're positive, positive mothers, uh, you're supposed to be breastfeeding exclusively. You only give the baby breast milk from the time they're given birth to to the time they're six months. Mm. 